Dearly beloved, we're gathered here today to join this man and this woman in the holy bonds of matrimony. We are here as family and friends of both Ryan and Ellie, and we're here because we love them. Allison, you are an adventurous spirit. You have a dynamic energy about you. And you have a very quiet strength. Ryan, you are a faithful friend. You're a compassionate warrior. You're a confident leader. I see you as best friends at the core, and you have an amazing togetherness. You have an emotional togetherness, and that you are tuned into each other's needs. You have a recreational togetherness, and that you have fun and excitement as a couple and enjoy the beauty and artistry of life. You have a spiritual togetherness and you're constantly drawing closer to God and encouraging each other in your faith. Right now you're surrounded by a cohort of people who support you and will do everything they can to uphold you through life. You worship a God who is intimate with you and who deeply loves you and has a wonderful plan for your lives. Ryan, do you take Allie to be your wedded wife, to live together after God's ordinance in the holy state of matrimony? Will you love her, comfort her, honor her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep yourself only unto her, so long as you both shall live? I do. And Allie, do you take Ryan to be your wedded husband, to live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony? Will you love him, comfort him, honor him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep yourself only unto him so long as you both shall live? I do. Good job. <laughs> in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Ryan, you may kiss your bride. <laughs>